Hey everyone, it's Julie here, and I wanted to hop on. I've been talking about doing this video for a really long time, um, and I just never have. I'm kind of nervous to do my lashes on video because I can whip through and do them super quick on my own. I've never done them live before, and I also need my mirror. So I have you guys like set up on a tripod. I have my mirror in front of me. So we're gonna see how this goes. But um, this came up again today. Uh, a friend was asking me about the lashes that I wear, and so I wanted to finally hop on here. It was like the push that I needed <laughs> to hop on here and do this video. So um, the the first question was just about like lashes in general. So I used to do the extensions where they glue them on one by one. And I love them. I love how they look. They're a lot more natural. You don't do anything to them. You have to have them refilled every couple weeks. Um, the only thing with that is my lashes are really, really fine. And no matter who I've gone to, they have... Um, my lashes have broken off and I've been left with little stubs and they just don't last They literally fall off within like a week week and a half. So most people they last a lot longer So then it comes down to either these little buds that I'll show you or individual lashes or strip lashes I've done strip before I Can't stand them. They drive me crazy. I, they're a bitch to put on I can feel them when they're on and for some reason no matter how much I trim them they always poke the inside of my eye either like the inside here or the skin underneath and I am left with like a raw spot from them poking my eye um, when I was in Vegas last week or two weeks ago already holy shit two weeks ago already <laughs> um, I ended up wearing strip ashes because it was all I had on me and then um, it was one night they drove me crazy so I went and got went to Walgreens and found my buds so I'll show you what I like you can get these at Walgreens or at CBS or really anywhere. And these ones I just ordered on Amazon. So if you get them from Walgreens or CVS, they are um, half medium and half short. And I like the medium ones and the short ones, honestly, you can't see on me at all. So what I end up doing is buying the medium ones and then throwing them out. So I, or, and using the mediums, throwing the small ones out. So what I did is I found these ones on Amazon and I can post the link after. Um, I found these on Amazon. And these ones are just medium. So these are what I like. And so each one has three little buds. And so you just put, um, I'll show you guys. You just put those on one by one with each of the buds. And I can fit about seven to eight for each bud. And then for the glue, it's strip glue, but it works for these two. It's the same, pretty much the same thing. But I like the black glue. And this is Kiss. This is just like the Walgreens um, black glue for that. So... I already have my makeup done. If I'm doing eyeliner, where is my, okay, if I'm doing eyeliner, I will put my eyeliner on first, um, and I do my makeup, and then I do just one coat of mascara, and then this is like my, my mascara's from earlier, so I am just going to curl my lashes. And you guys are gonna laugh. I'm not gonna tell you where I'm going tonight, because nobody will believe me. And you guys are gonna laugh your asses off, so you have to wait for that. All right. So what I like to do is I will take, I hope you guys can see this. I'll just take my tweezers and pull one of them off just so I have that little pocket open there. And then that's where I'm gonna put my glue. And that just speeds everything up because everything is like right there. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of glue in there So that's about how much glue I put in there. And I like to start on the outside and move in for both eyes. Like I said, I hope this is gonna, I hope I'm gonna be able to see what I'm doing. I wonder if I can look and use that. Mm, no, I don't think so. All right, I'm trying to figure out which I wanna use as my mirror. So I just take the tweezers with um, the lashes. I dip them in the glue a little bit. And then I just go right in on top and just set it down as close to the lash line and the lashes as I can. So you shouldn't feel them at all. Like I literally have no clue that I'm wearing these when I am wearing them. And so you don't need a lot of glue. I don't know if you guys can see how much is on even like this thing here. You don't need a lot of glue at all. And the glue gets kind of tacky, you, like it's not going to dry instantly, so you have some time to play with it. And 
And of course, the first time you do this, it's not gonna be this easy. And the more you do it, you'll kind of get the hang of it and get a routine done. And there are some days I can like fly through these in two minutes. And there are some days where I will rip half of them off and put them back on. But the nice thing about these is you can just take a couple buds off and put them back on if you want. It's not like the strip where you have to get the entire strip to cooperate at the same time. I also like to go when I pull them off, I do the same row because that way it kind of keeps count of how many I'm putting on each eye. For some reason I always end up with like eight on one and seven on the other though. And then I got a little bit of glue up there. I might be able to hide that with just some liner. Or you can even take like a little Q-tip and it usually pulls right off. So there have been times where, so when I get, so first of all, taking these off, they just peel right off. This is kind of like a, a tacky glue. So when you pull them off, it just comes right off. It's not gonna stick to your lashes. It's not gonna rip any of them out. Um, and it doesn't hurt at all. There have definitely been times where I've slept in them. And as long as they're not like jacked up from the pillow, bending them, I've worn them sometimes two or three days in a row. And then if you do have one that is um, like loose or kind of hanging or falls off, you can always like just stick that one back on. So then that's it. That's really how easy they are. So you can see this side I have the lashes done, this side I don't. I'm trying to keep this eye closed just a little bit because if I have any um, glue that's still a little wet up there, I just don't want it going on my lid. I mean, I could easily take it off with, with um, a Q-tip. But yeah, so this one's done, this one's not. What I'll do now is I will take, once, it's, once I know it's completely dry, I will take my mascara and just do a tiny little bit of mascara again, just to kind of seal my lashes to the um, to these ones. And it just kind of like, you know, sticks them together. And then what you could do is take like a little tiny brush like this, or maybe even a smaller one to do like a little bit of liner up at the top. Um, but with the black glue, I've noticed I really don't need to because if I'm doing liner already, then um, I don't really need to. So here I did one, two, three, four. So I did eight total on this side. Um, Sarah, yeah, I will shower in them. I'm just kind of like careful about my face and drying around my, my eyes. But that's it. That is how simple they are and I literally can't feel them at all. And then sometimes too, I will take, um, cause I could probably fit one more on the inside but I don't wanna get like too close right now and poke myself in the eye. But sometimes I'll also take like a little bit of, um, eyeliner and just do like a little bit there too just to kind of like darken that so it it isn't like an abrupt stop with my lashes but that's it and it makes such a difference <laughs> it's actually kind of weird seeing just one so i hope that helped you guys have been asking me for this video forever um but yeah these are the ones that i love these little buds that have three and then black glue is my favorite um like i said i've tried the strip they're a pain in the ass <laughs> And I wish I could do extensions all the time. But yeah, hope this helps and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.